Hey everybody, welcome back. Happy to be here playing some Super Auto Pets. I don't mind this at all. I honestly, I've come around to the idea of this team in the early game. Let me be a um, let me be a moody masseuse. Is that too much pressure? Yeah, good. What the heck? Easiest win of my life. Cockroach is going to be, it, it's going to remain 1-4. No, it's going to become 2-4. That's right. I'm smart. Um, I actually think we take our level early on the pill bug because it allows us to get 2 HP instead of 1. We don't really, I don't think we want to run two buffed cockroaches. I'm happy to throw a wombat out there. I don't really, I, I expect most teams will be running like an ant. And maybe later they'll be running like a spider or something. So we should still get some value out of it. Plus we'll get the 2 HP. Now I don't want to say I told us so. But look at that. There's a strong team. The, now we pay the toll though. Which is not uh, having had the ability to... Uh, get a level up on this turn instead. Why don't you try? Let's see if we can get you pumping a little bit here. No hurt triggers. I guess I would rather buy a 2-2, even if it's not going to stick around. I would rather buy a 2-2 than just 2 attack. Because we can always sell this back for 1 and then put it into something more relevant. So we're going to get a spider. I don't know, though. I'm, I'm always wary of going up against a, a kangaroo, because they can pop off real easily. We're going to win this one. Now, that's a strong team. To beat that team feels very nice. I don't think we replace anything yet. There's, I don't see a compelling reason. I do think meat on you makes some sense. Another mosquito. I'm just not sold. Wombat, I would at least... Like, our levels are all askew here. But I think that our, our strategy remains sane. I've copied your flamingo's ability. Pray I don't copy it further. I have been killed. <laughs> oh, but I have buffed. And we'll win this one, too. God bless the cockroaches, man. Thank you. Okay, go ahead. <clears throat> I would say for now, get sold. Oh, we have a level. Okay, level up then. Whoa. Okay, okay. This is not a joke. I think we obviously want scaling. And I think we do also want a dragonfly afterwards. We don't really care about a mosquito. Not dragonfly, sorry, a dolphin afterwards. I don't think we really care about a cockroach. It wouldn't be the worst thing in the world if it got to level three. Just because it would help our dragonfly scaling. But our pill bug is so much closer to making that dream a reality for us. I feel like we're on a, a really nice sort of path here. Greatness is not guaranteed, but there's... It, you know, it's a little bit more frictionless than it was the last few rounds. Like, this is already five wins in five rounds, right? Yeah, okay. So you're gone. You're like Gogurt, but to stay. Really want to see a pill bug. Very interesting. Two dolphins. Very much will screw up our scaling a little further, potentially, or at least not benefit our scaling. But I don't think it's bad because a level two dolphin is actually just going to be better for us than what we presently had. So, oh, dude, I copied their armadillo. Let's go. <laughs> All right, so that's six in six rounds. I'm going to say yes. I do feel like I would love to add a crocodile. Am I willing to do it at the expense of our scaling? I think I am. I think the sniping will, will help us out more. You might as well level. I think, and I'm not saying we're going to get a flawless. This seems like a team that has no late game, so we better dominate the early game. And it's, it's hard because we're running into a lot of blowfish teams without a doubt, but... It's also, it, I mean, it doesn't look that bad. It actually looks pretty good. So let's win seven in seven rounds. Keep the scaling coming. Who needs it? I mean, if anything, you could use, like, some garlic at this stage of the game. You could probably also use a little extra. 
little extra survivability. Work with me here. Work with me. Kill that vulture. Thank you. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I love to see it. Nom, 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 nom. And then I'm going to copy. I'm going to copy uh, probably your anteater, I suppose. I'm going to. Nom, 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 nom. I don't even know if that's good for us. It doesn't matter. Level two anteater. That's eight wins, eight rounds. I think I really just want to see like scaling foods. I also feel like instead of meat, maybe you should just have a chili pepper. Scaling foods. I'm gonna take a lark and I'm gonna tr try to buy some honey here. I'm really thinking like it's, you gotta get 10 real quick or you may never get 10 at all. So, I'm, all I'm saying is be ready, okay? And I think we are gonna get to nine. I know we're gonna get to nine. I would love to see some scaling foods because the team doesn't have that much further to grow. Okay, go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. I got to tell you, it would hit the spot, man. A true flawless with this squad would hit the spot. Please. It's a strong looking team. But we got some strength of our own. I have an ant. I think we might have done it. We did it. Oh my God. Malv was asking me the other day, how many flawlesses have you got? Um, quick print. Add that to my cringe collection. Let's go. I'm, listen, you don't have to be good to get a flawless, necessarily. What I would say is, a, and I, I said this to Malf when he asked me the very question that I posed to you earlier. Mm, I should have bought the cockroach turn one instead. I'll be a fragile fungi. It's more of a measure of how good your shops were. And I think if, if I'm being straight up and 100% honest with you, what gave us the best chance of the flawless there when we got that early level to dolphin? At that point, I really felt like like the the world opened up to us. I actually think now we want to run it like this, maybe. I know the order looks horrible. It might be horrible. But it's like, you know, sometimes making a team in Super Auto Pets is like constructing a sentence in the English language. Just because it looks like it breaks all the rules doesn't mean you're not doing things right. Sometimes that's exactly what you gotta do. I before E, except after C, except in this one unique situation where uh, uh, XYZ instead. Hold on. We should have popped that. That's the whole reason I did it in the first place was to pop it down next to it. But whatever we got there, whatever we got there. Okay, move to the front. Moth to the back. No. You to the back. Pineapple on the dolphin and we're looking okay. So we had 11 straight wins followed by one draw. Oh, the misery. Everybody wants to be my enemy. No, 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 no. We're, we're fine. This is why you take honey. This is why you put the... We didn't even need the honey. Never mind. Nobody really benefits from a croissant, unfortunately. You could take some meat. I do want to see a pineapple. You're going to level next turn. Beautiful. I'll keep you around. I don't know about you. I think we kind of made our choice. We're, we're probably not modding. I'm missing the HP scaling from the pill bug, though. I don't think this team is as good as the last one. But it's doing, it's doing something. Don't take my meat. Don't take my meat. Feeling good, though. Three teams, three wins. A level. I think we should sell. And buy. And buy and freeze and roll. I don't see a pineapple. You're at level. I got to think about this one. I'm still looking for a pineapple. I don't see one. I'll freeze it. It's a very, very frozen shop here. But early scaling, it doesn't matter if it's bad because it's early. Holy cow, that is a strong cockroach. That's incredibly scary. Or is it? Or is it? It is. It is. We're going to draw. Dude, we're keep, we're, we haven't lost in 10 minutes. It's crazy. Why don't you level me first? Genuinely, I think you handle it like that. 
then we, we know we're going to scale these two units every time. You're going to be one away. The meat's still doing wonders for you. Knowing that you're going to get at least one one per turn and knowing this won't override meat, I'm going to put garlic on our ants and we're, gonna, we're just going to hope that the cockroach gets to level three soon enough for the ant to be guaranteed a buff from the dragonfly every time. It's a very scary team yet again. Never mind, it's not scary at all. I keep sandbagging. I'm very glad we sniped their crocodile though. Or sorry, their kangaroo. I'm ignoring this. I think we're gonna, I'm betting we're gonna find one cockroach before two more ants. And I'm gonna buff you. I'm gonna buy you. And I'm gonna buy you. But there is a world in which maybe we sell the dolphin to fit the second dragonfly or even maybe sell the penguin, dare I say. But I, I think the dragonfly is gonna, gonna get us there. I'm hoping the dragonfly is gonna get us there. It's gonna be a loss. It's gonna be a win. Never mind. I continue to sandbag. I think the ant luck might have taken us out of draw territory. Okay, a level. Very, very nice for our scaling. Come on. Pill bug me. Don't. This is second ants. Don't keep track, okay? I know you're gonna keep track, but don't keep track. Just take some more attack. It's okay, we're still popping. Now our penguin will start to buff our dragonfly, that's true. So it is, it's, it's made our scaling better but worse. Strong team. And yet, and yet we remain two scalers stronger. Level two dolphin would be nice. I think we could go lemon over meat. We know we're going to want to do it at some point eventually. Why not now? Put a, put a honey on just to keep things rolling. This wide scaling, though, I don't know if it's as good as I need it to be, but as long as our snipes keep hanging strong, I'm not sweating it all that much. I'm starting to sweat it. I'm not sweating it in the slightest, actually. Every round feels like we're going to lose, and then we win. It's beautiful. That's our third ant. And yet now I definitely can't buy them because it's a sunk cost. Roll me. I would set as our fourth ant. <laughs> I would settle for, for good scaling foods at this point. I also wouldn't mind seeing, you know, another penguin. Wouldn't mind seeing another dolphin. Wouldn't mind seeing the two penguins, not just the one. Okay, we're going to lose this one. This, this has taken some of the, the intrigue out of it. It's just a very strong team. And now I'm scared, because we could fall off pretty quick. I'm not, it's not going to damage my self-esteem if we only get seven this time. I'd still be pretty pleased with that. Come on. It's got to be better than this. A pair is fine, I suppose. Sushi is not what I'm looking for. I, probably at this point we should have saved the cat and gotten rid of this penguin. I, I'm playing a little too quick. But we got seven HP. There's still, even if this round also goes badly, there's a chance to pivot out of it. Nothing's guaranteed. That's very unfortunate. Okay, we, we, gotta, we gotta strengthen the team. And the penguin is the obvious uh, squeaky wheel. It has to go. Increase your scaling maybe on the ant, because it already has a lemon. And there's another penguin. <laughs> we might as well roll. Nothing there appeals to me. Not even good foods. There's something about a cat, possibly. But honestly, at two away from lethal, I think we're kind of like pot committed to the idea of the monkey here. But I don't think we have quite enough stats to, to reliably think that we're getting to 10. Now, going up against a, um, a, a spawning team, I think our lemons might actually get us there. Nobody's more surprised by it than me. It's just not that strong of a team, but maybe it, it matches up well against some other teams. But that, that was blessed for us, for sure. We don't really need another lemon at this point. Pears, I will accept. We're not getting enough. We're not getting enough. You know what, for now, I'll spend three gold on, on honey. It's just honey and a prayer. 
Eight is still good. Eight is still respectable. I'm priming you, so when we win eight, you go, hey, don't be toxic. He still won eight. That's pretty good. Okay, this one's toast. But it is true. Like, that's by necessity. That's an above average score, I think. I'm not going to run the mathematical proof, but it sounds right. But we're... Mostly, it's like... You know, there's two different ways you can approach eight wins. One is, it looked like you were going to get to ten, and then you fell off. That looks bad. The other is, it looked like you were going to die at two, and now you're scaling fast enough that as long as you just encounter average teams, you would expect to beat them. We're in, like a, we're in a different situation. What does our situation look like? Listen. Our situation looks like um, it would take a miracle for us to beat the average scaling team right now. So just hanging on feels okay. Although this team, if I may say so, they might beat me, but they don't seem that scary. Although you're a level, oh, no, they're gonna, they're gonna kill me. No, we're gonna win thanks to the honey. Oh my God, the psychotic honey. All right, maybe there's a 10 piece. It, we gotta, in my personal opinion, I still can't believe we haven't seen a pill bug and yet we've seen like seven ants. In my personal opinion, I was thinking. Um, in my personal opinion, I think we need to match up against like a, a pretty bad like vulture type team. Wait a minute. Hold on. Hold on. We actually, I, I sort of don't believe it. That's two 10 pieces in a row. That one I genuinely was not trying to sandbag on at the end of the game. In the mid game, we, you know, I just had my, I just wasn't right in my evaluation. I hate these, I hate this team right now. I will sell you, I will buy you, and I will roll once. And I will be happy for you to help us out next time. And two fish maybe as well. Um, let me be a bald legend. I, I, I have to say it, I got two 10 pieces in a row. I really didn't think in the late game we stood a chance, but we, we narrowly made it. So this has been a kind of a, a landmark video thus far. I'm, I'm very proud of myself. Give me two on top. I love it. <laughs> I, we shouldn't keep everything frozen, but I'm gonna. We're going to miss out on a tier 2 as a result, but I would rather have a, a tier 1 that I know matches with what we got versus a tier 2 that could be anything. It could even be a boat. Okay, it's a draw, but it's a, a draw that I am not minding. So, take this level. I don't want the dog. I, I, you know what? I'm, let me see. Cell takes you to 8. No, I don't want the dog. Level me. Definitely do want a kangaroo. And he'd be like, bang. I feel like position two makes sense, but there is a part of me that's like, there might be moths. If there's moths, we would rather have like cockroach duck kangaroo. So I'm going to bet on the anti-moth. I'm going to keep a croissant frozen. Because we're really... Like, the kangaroo, as long as it doesn't get sniped, can really pop. So you could even broccoli your kangaroo. Although broccoliing the unit in front of the kangaroo also makes sense. So that the kangaroo can get more triggers. But if they have a dolphin, the kangaroo's going to get sniped, which is very bad for business. Dolphins are not, like, guaranteed to be out right now, but they should be showing up more likely pretty soon. So I think we, we take some time to get yourself set up. There's one win. Then, I think buff me, buff me, roll, and I'm gonna buy just because we can. And then we gotta talk about this, this loyal chinchilla. That hurt. That one's, that one's gonna keep you up at night. Or is it? Or maybe, maybe I'm sandbagging again and we're gonna actually be completely fine. Yep, yep. Confirmed. Okay, feeling okay. More kangaroos early would obviously be nice. You know what else would be nice, actually? I think a rabbit just makes a lot of sense. And roll. 
We got another fish. I feel like if the fish is going to stick around, let's get it scaling to the point where it may become... Like, now we can move the cockroach back, run duck as the killer, fish as the tank, and kangaroo as the, as the DPS. To put it in terms that make fundamentally no sense. This is minus one attack for plus four health. I think it's like an ideal duck food right now. Got any nails? Got any duck food? Classic joke, by the way. Kangaroo, you can do it. Dude, this is a strong team to, to beat. This is a strong team to beat. Did you see that Emperor Tamarin? I'm feeling great. No sniper, though. No sniper kind of hurts. Very nice. Thank you so much. Why don't you just take some garlic for now? Everybody's got relevant foods. The cockroach can go. The cockroach can now go in favor of maybe like a lynx. Would hit the spot, man. This is highly unfortunate. My math. My, my math. My math! <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm not used to losing, okay? Especially in a situation I could have frozen a... Uh, could have frozen a snail there. Okay, let's, let's, the dolphin is, is late. But, check this out. Holy. So Dolphin's doing three damage to lowest health. Lynx is going to do eight damage. I'm sorry to do this. Like, the order is all messed up. But let's avoid the sunk cost fallacy that time. That's what I'm hoping for, is more Lynx as fast as possible. Now, the Rabbit is the next to go. Would I replace Rabbit with Dolphin? That's a hard sell for me at this point, given that I just bought and sold a, a rabbit on the very last turn. That would hurt me deep in my soul. I think what I'm hoping is that I could maybe just get a level 2 kangaroo and that stuff wouldn't be as relevant, but I don't know. I'm not running two rabbits. Not, not right now. As tempting as it is, I think everything is like kind of indispensable. I think you're going to need this. You also need some attack. We're going to need some scaling food coming your way. Give me this. Give me this and roll me. Great foods to feed to your fish. Volume 1. The pear. If it's going to stick around as a level 3 despite never having any more utility, that's where we, we got to take it. Good hit. Good hit. This is looking fantastic. It's a great time to have garlic on your kangaroo. Still feeling good. Still feeling great. It would also be a great time to have a level 2 kangaroo for the record, but that's fine. I would purchase you. Definitely seems tempting to me to sell a rabbit in favor of a monkey and then run the squad like that. At which point, the fish would definitely benefit... It's tempting to sell a duck for a crocodile, huh? The fish would definitely benefit from some lemon or some garlic at this point. But more than any, this whole point, in my opinion, is moot if we don't somehow find ourselves getting to a level 2 kangaroo before things get, like, too nasty. Like, right now, it's been, it's been a very gentle ascent, but, uh, you know, things change quick. Life comes at you fast. Or do you just double scale... With the, like, I think you could sell, double scale your fish, and I know how this sounds, and I know how it looks. We just keep two crocodiles frozen until you find like a crocodile or a monkey, and we'll we'll take the lynx level up next turn for sure. And I'm like, man, this fish is like he's hard to kill, unless they have a scorpion. But then we have a lynx sort of backing us up as a just in case me. I think this team might have the sauce, man. And it's scary. As soon as I start to get, like, a, a little ahead of myself on that stuff, then uh, that's where it usually starts crashing down. But I, it might not. It may not. That's seven, and we still got a lot of life left. Like, this is great. I don't really want an orca. I definitely want this. Nothing of, of extreme usefulness here. I'm going to just give my kangaroo a little extra juice. 
Our monkeys are gonna, they're gonna be snipe targets, which is completely fine. Lynx killed our Lynx. Not that big of a deal. I'm alive. I'm still alive. What is this gonna be? This is gonna be nine wins or, or eight wins? This is eight. God, I would still love that level two kangaroo, man. Nope. Very nice still. You have two, three. We're gonna be like at max scaling pretty soon. I thought about the cat there for a second, and then I thought to myself, you know, I just don't think it's just don't think it's strictly necessary. I understand how this looks now, having like rolled for nothing and having kept two crocodiles frozen for a long time when we're begging for something else in our shop, but like we're we're bas we're trying to you know we're a sixty forty portfolio right now okay we're trying to keep uh, some allocation of stocks and some allocation of bonds even if we think that one of them has higher expected returns than the other we're trying to make we're trying to say that we don't know what we're talking about so we're gonna hedge our bets we're gonna take a little of column A and a little column B and hope that it smooths volatility over the long haul. Now this is also fine in my opinion. I think you can, especially with you getting close to max. You could just go, hey, real quick, level two kangaroo. And now, honestly, I'm not that disappointed that I kept them frozen. And we got two pretty serious snipers here. Even if it didn't die, the shark being, like, wounded, I don't think it's going to be enough. But it's it feels helpful. <laughs> Even if the shark had died, it wouldn't have done enough for us, okay? So that's... Maybe it's copium, but that's just a very strong team. Take it. Now I'm like, we really don't need this on anybody. What we need is, quite frankly, that level two kangaroo we've been asking for for a long time. Oh, I meant to freeze it. You could see what my, my finger was doing. I meant to freeze it. I know, I know the scaling is like, it looks off here. But, like, it's a level one monkey. Like, we gotta... I, just give me the attack. I'm happy to have it. Good snipe. Good kill. Please. Please. We can't do it. It can't be done. We're just a little bit shy. Okay. We got one more left. Please. I need a level two kangaroo. Maybe, like, get rid of the monkey. I, I know. I know. It could be... It could give us plus four attack. But I think I need... I need, basically, I need a scorpion or I need another sniper. So forget the monkey for now. I know how that looks. I'm telling you, I think it's the right play. I don't think you're the sniper I need. I'm being very greedy. Listen, we can't not. Like, we, it's, it's foundational. And if we lose this as a result, so be it. It had it, it showed up at the perfect time for comedy. It certainly looks like we probably lost. It certainly looks like we 100% lost. It hurts me a little bit, spiritually speaking, but I can't deny a 10 10 9 video is still pretty sick, as including a flawless in it. Hey, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, click the like button. Helps out a great deal. Of course, subscribe if you want to see more in the future. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. See ya.